Hi, I've had a play along version of This Need Not Be for some time now, and I thought some of you might like to try it out for yourselves. It's microtonal, but the solo part covers only one octave it's from middle C to the higher C. So, what you need to know is how to place the valve slides, and this will help make it very easy to play in tune. All right, so what we have to do is the um, we're going to set the valve slides. This is just an F horn, so all the notes for the solo play it can be uh, to be played on the F horn. Doesn't matter whether you've got a double horn or not. Just play them on the F side. Now we're going to change the um, the first slide to match a simple shift here. We're going to match <coughs> the ninth harmonic of first valve to the eighth harmonic of the open horn. So here's the eighth harmonic. So I tuned it slightly too fat, flat. Here we are. That'll do it. All right. So now. We're going to tune the third valve <clears throat> like this. So the sixth harmonic of the third valve will equal the fifth harmonic of the open horn. Maybe that's too flat too. Let's try this one. Somewhere in between. Let's try here. Still slightly flat. I like that one. All right. Now the second valve, <clears throat> we're going to fix it so the the B is in tune. Now it's the note I'm going to play now, a very high note, is only for the tuning. All right. So we're going to tune. The 15th harmonic. So the second slide needs to come out fractionally. Now I like that one. And that means the B in that range will be just what we want. All right. So you don't have to play any high C's or high B's, anything like that. Whereas that was just for tuning. Now if you can do it by ear. It's a slightly wide semitone, all right? Now, so what happens then is the, the other, we're going to use the other combinations, and they should work nicely now, all right? So what we're going to test out one like the, um, the 11th harmonic on the open horn, and we're going to match the 14th harmonic of this horn. So that we can play the eleventh harmonic in the low octave. And that'll work beautifully. Alright? Now the um so what we also have to do make sure is our um one and three combo. Matches up. That's pretty good. You might have to do a slight adjustment with your hand or your lip there. And also all three valves. So the seventh harmonic of this, your B horn, will equal the fifth harmonic of your F horn. All right, so now we're good to go.
Thank you.